Welcome to Matrix Part 1 Routing. We've already set optimum input gain levels for our, all of our mic and line level devices, and now we're ready to route those inputs to outputs. Let's select the Matrix tab, and in the DM1624, we have 384 cross points. Right now, all of the cross points are currently off. So to route input 1 to output 1, as an example, all we have to do is go to the cross point, right click, and select Enable Cross Point. Now it's set up at 0 dB. Input 1 is routed to output number 1. You have a little color table here to the side so that when you look at the matrix at a, with a quick glance you can get a feel for what the level of an individual cross point is. So as an example, if I wanted to set this particular cross point to plus 10 dB, there's a couple of ways I can do it. One way, I can right click and select cross point gain and I can select the up arrow and go to plus 10 or I can type 10 on the keyboard. I'll select OK and now you'll notice it's yellow to indicate it's within the plus 1 to plus 10 dB range. Okay, so let's say I want to set input number 3 to output number 1 at exactly the same value. Well, I can do this. I can right click, select copy cross point. I can go to input 3 to output number 1, right click and say paste cross point. Now, let's simply enable other cross points. 4 to 1, 5 to 1, 6 to 1, 7 to 1, and so on. Now, what if, I, I know what you're thinking already, what if I already know that I want these particular inputs routed, but I also want these same inputs routed to output number 2? Well, look how easy this is. I'll right click on output number 1, say copy column, let's select that. Go to number 2, right click, select paste column, and now I get an exact duplicate. Well, what if I want to route all 16 inputs to output number 3. Look how easy this is. I'll simply click on input number 1 to output number 3. Now I'll hold the shift key down and I will click on input 16 to output number 3. Everything selected. I'll right click and select enable cross point and now all of them are automatically set for me. Now this will also work. Let's say that you want to select random inputs to random outputs, but you want to set them all at the same cross point gain. Well, let's do this. I'm going to hold down I'm going to hold down the control key. Okay? Then let's just select the cross points that we like, whatever they may be. And once again, right click and select enable cross point. And notice now that we have those particular cross points that we selected routed. How easy is that? Now, let's say you want to clear a column. Here's a very simple way to clear a column. Let's go to an empty column, and let's select cop, uh, paste, uh, copy column. <laughs> now what we're doing is we've copied all of those empty cells. Let's go to number three, select paste column, and it automatically clears that column for us. Very easy to do. Let's go on to part two, which will show you how to set the modes.